My first concert was, uh, remember that band Ambrosia? Yeah. Uh, and, th you know, they always had, the, the only songs that ever became famous for them were their ballads, mm -hmm. but they were total, like, drugged out, you know, yeah. pot smoking, Very heavy sexist. metal band. And uh, so I went there kind of expecting this, you know, like an air supply concert. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And it was, like, totally heavy, and, and that's kind of, and it was a great show, great rock show. Nice. My first concert was Kiss opening for Savoy Row wow. in Seattle. I slept on the street outside. Right. Did you? My first concert was Motley Crue. Really? No, no, I'm sorry. When I was 16, my dad took me to my, uh, it's my birthday present. Yeah. I was only 17 when I was playing. <laughs> <laughs> Just age-wise. But yeah, so it's cool. Oh, that's a great question. I think uh, mine was uh, Molly Hatchet. Molly Hatchet. Flirting with Disaster. Yeah. Oh, God. I remember mine because this Hannah Montana? Might have been. Yeah. Hannah Montana? You started with Hannah, I think. <laughs> <laughs> right, you know, no. What was the first record you stole? <laughs> I, re I remember there was this girl, and she, it's still a problem for me. If girls wear little short cutoffs and tube tops, I'm done. And it was my friend's sister, and she used to walk around, and I, she told me, I wanted to go buy Deep Purple Record, and she told me I had to buy uh, Harry Nielsen, Nielsen Smilson, mm -hmm. uh, so I did. Uh, I caved right out, of, right out of the box, I caved in. It's a great album, though. It's got, uh, I honestly don't Make a note that. of that. No more wearing shorts and two tops. Yeah. <laughs> <Exactly. laughs> I honestly don't remember. My mom had a huge collection of, like, Elvis. Like, she was, like, a, I think... You think Elvis. maybe your Elvis is so? I, I, I doubt it. But maybe from her collection. <laughs> <laughs> You know what? I don't. I don't listen to music on my iPod. I uh, I have one of those iPod touches, and I just I can buy TV shows. So I have the whole Dexter series, oh, yeah. which is a great series. Amazing. Have you, have you seen yes, that? Yes. The, the new uh, the second season comes out real soon. On on uh, on iTunes. Yeah. I'm so it's excited. Killer. Mine's probably phone numbers and porn. Important. Doesn't surprise me. They, should, <laughs> they, they, they probably tie together, don't they? Kind of, a little bit. <laughs> a little cross, a little cross platform. Yeah, I don't exactly. really listen to music on. I, I really iPod. don't either. Nice I, I do. I do in the iPod dock. Oh, you do? Yeah. yeah. That's the only time. I can't put earphones in. So yeah, yeah, I just plug it in my car. Whatever's on it, yeah. plays. So, oh, so the question is, what's on our iPod? Mine, mine has everything from country to classical, to you name it. You know what? Right now, I like Paramore. I think Paramore is a really cool band with that, you know, that chick singer. Mm -hmm. Yeah, great, great pop song. And I like Flyleaf. Flyleaf is great too. Yeah. Um, I like our band. The Ben Sevenfold. Yeah, it's great band. Let's be honest. Yeah. It's, to me, it's about being able to play live and be able to write songs. That 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 yeah. cross. Where for a while it was songwriting was pop music and rock was just like live music and now it's like getting great songs and, and be able to tour it live and get the audience for it. Yeah. Uh, mine, my first one would probably be uh, ABBA, the Millennium Collection. That's Rare. not, that doesn't count. Why not, man? You can't have a whole, that's like saying you have a box set. <laughs> It's she cheating. needed it, so it's one CD? Uh, well, you know, uh, I, should, I should help you with this. If you're going to have the music, are you going to die or are you going to live? It's a big decision. You're going to die. So you're going to die? So it's, it's it's music to die by. Music to die mm, by. I like that. <laughs> yeah. Forget the <laughs> desert island. That's okay. a good ring. What is, what is your music to die by? Now that's a question. Music to die by. I guess it's got to be music by dead people only. That's the other parameter. So if you're going to die on the island, music, and by dead people. All right, by dead people. Well, you just name three dead guys in the room. Yeah, can just dead? Gene Simmons. <laughs> no, he's not dead yet. That's very good. That's good. Jimi Hendrix, Mama Cass. We're not Please. answering this question. No, let's, 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 let's do this. Let's do this. What are, like, three favorite CDs. 
What Air, are three Aeros favorite Aerosmith teams? rocks. There you go. That's a good one. Uh, I'm going to go with, uh, you know, I'll go with um, uh, Black Crow's uh, Southern Harmony. Fleetly Mac Rumors. Great That's one. Good record, right? Great one. Um, DJ, come on, help us out, man. Let's do I, some love, more. I love Bad Out of Hell. Go first. Yeah, I'm sure. Okay. Yeah. yeah. So we got four. I love Nightmare right, that's Christmas good enough. So we soundtrack. Because we're going to be together. It's, it's the great ringtone, actually, but everyone has it. It's the actual it's like phone Captain ring. Kirk. No, it's the phone ring from uh, that, that uh, TV old? show 24. Oh, I just uh, have the old classic boring bell. Yeah. You yeah. have great ringtones. <laughs> that's his ringtone. That's, that's awesome. That's great. <laughs> Hear my ringtone? <laughs> that was great. Told right. you. I wouldn't like. Go DJ, ahead. DJ, talk, talk about your uh, talk about your uh, ringtones that you created. Yeah, yes. I, I composed a couple of ringtones. Um, you know, I enjoyed doing right. like orchestra type stuff. Too, so right? I got a couple of really good ones that you know I have on my phone. One of my favorites is called "A Bearded Lady." <laughs> so, right. That's kind of my default. Your ringtones? Yeah. Yeah, they're good. Take sleeping pills. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's pretty much it, right? That's pretty much it. Yeah. I think I think every one of us get up, we go in the studio, and we start yeah. making music. Yeah. And we can't sleep. Yeah. We watch porn. And it, My ex-girlfriend. That was good. <laughs> that was good. Stupid, stupid. <laughs>